Thank you for calling the Vlasic Groucho Marx Impersonation Contest. If you've got a great Groucho Marx impersonation, you can win the chance to star as the voice of the Vlasic Stork in an upcoming Vlasic commercial. Groucho. Entry is quick and easy. All you need to do is give your best Groucho Marx impersonation of the famous Vlasic line. Now that's the best tasting pickle I've ever heard. To enter, please clearly state the following. Your name. Um, Ned Von Pickle the fourth. Your age. Uh, 102. That's in pickle years, so. though. Your address with the city and state you live in. Uh, 6969 Cucumber Lane. Pickle Jar, my Wisconsin. Now it's time to give your best Groucho Marx impersonation of the Vlasic Stork line. That's the best tasty pickle I've ever heard. I don't do phone auditions. The operator. Be a real person. Hello? Vlasic Foods International. Uh, yes, hello. Uh, I was calling about this um, this here uh, Groucho Marx uh, impersonation thing. Uh, you got well, going? Well, we have an eight hundred number for well, that. Yeah, but I don't. I don't want to talk to uh, no recording. I want. I want to talk to somebody live. Well, that's the way we we have it set up for you to record. Well, I do, look, I just want to talk to somebody because I want to tell you this this Groucho sh that ain't funny. I mean, maybe. well, Groucho has been our spokesperson for about twenty five years, and we're pretty happy with that. Well, you know, maybe in the forties, that was you know that was funny. But come on, I mean, let's you got to let it go. I mean, that's the best tasting pickle I've ever heard. That's fucking lame. I mean, you need a new slogan. You need sure. you need a new spokesman. You, you got to rework the whole deal. I think you need to call our eight hundred number. No, no, listen. Here's what you got to do. You need a whole new spokesman with with more attitude. Like uh, Andrew Dash Clay. Well, sir, we're happy with Groucho. Well, you look, you look, you, I'm just trying to help you out here. You need somebody with attitude. Now, you want people to think pickles. You get Andrew Dash Clay to talk about pickles, or remember your fucking pickle. You really need to call the 800 number. Well, no, I look, you just listen up. Hickory dickory dock. That pickle looks just like my Sir, please. And when I start jerking, my 14 inch gherkin. Sir. It squirts pickle juice into my socks. Oh, Sir, I think you need to call the 800 number. Now, that was good. That makes you just get you thinking about pickles, don't it? See, now here's another one. Mary had a little lamb. Oh, sir, I really don't want to hear another one. Whose fleece was white as snow. She'd use a pickle on that lamb like a f***ing green dildo. Oh. <laughs> Classic Foods International. Uh, Peter, Peter, pickle sucker. Oh, sir, I really have to hang up again. And a wife. But wouldn't f her. Oh, sir. He tried to put it in her. Pickles turned him f***ing queer. See? Pickles on the mind, don't you? You're starting to like it. Classic Foods International. The little Miss Muffet sat Please, on her tongue. Sir, I don't want to hear another one. Well, I was walking past. I gave her a nickel to pull out a pickle and stick that deal right up my. What's your name, sir? My name's Ned. Ned Dice Clay to you. Ned, please call the 800 number and don't call this number again. Jack, be nimble. Jack, be quick. Oh, my God. F*** them pickles, Jack. And my... Plastic Foods International. Jack and Bill went up the hill Ned. with a barrel full of pickles. I wound up in the emergency room. F***ing fags. Plastic Foods International. Jerry, Jerry, quite contrary. Licked my pickle. F***ing fairy. Classic Foods International. She who lived in a shoe. Oh, no. She had so many children, she didn't know what to I, do. I need to hang up now. So she started an internet site, pickles.com. Sir. Made millions. <laughs>